I don't know, they sell, they sell themselves. Like pretty much every boat we've showed to someone, we get an order out of. And if we don't get the order, it's normally because we can't accommodate what they want um, or they find something cheaper and, and then they come back and whinge about it. <laughs> Pambula River Mouth, all right, at the moment. <laughs> nah, I'm on a uh, 510 Dundee Pro, uh, Mad Dog. Uh, we actually manufacture, manufacture boats, aluminium boats. Our brand's Mad Dog, uh, love doing it. That's why we uh, keep doing it, and we build, custom build stuff for people. We're not a mass produce boat builder, so we're, we just yeah, pride ourselves on building the, the thing right from the start, and. The blokes we've got working on them are actually fabricators, they're not just blokes chucked in to do a job. So everything's welded, everything's fully welded. Um, under the floor, gussets welded in as, as much as we need to. There's no, there's no need to go overboard. You don't want too much heat into it. Um, but yeah, everything cleaned up is welded fully both sides and then cleaned up, not welded and then polished off like a lot of them. We just, as I said, we just pride ourselves in our workmanship and making sure stuff's done properly. Even the painter, we have a, a, a bloke comes in and paints them, he paints cars. That's why we get such a good finish on the paint jobs too. We don't rush them and get them right. The, the 461 Brute, yeah, just built strong. We just, yeah, extra, extra top hat in it, uh, extra runners under the floor. Just rides really well on the water. Just good all round boat. Three mil sides, three mil bottom. Yep, two, two meters and 50 beam, yep. Batteries under the floor. Um, just to keep the weight below center of gravity. Anchor shelf, anchor well can be bought into it as well for your consoles. Yeah, we can put casting decks up the front and stuff like that can add to weight. Battery up the front, sort of, yeah. But it, it doesn't really need the extra weight up the front the way they, they ride in the water. Uh, outboard, so 60 is the maximum on one of them, the 461. Yeah, so you can go either tiller or you can go yeah, center console or side console, either either option. But yeah, with a 60 on it, they, they go all right with a 40 or a 50 on them too. So it's uh, performance out of the Honda. Yeah, so really good bottom end. Um, so you got that, that good blast mode out to get it going. Um, and top end, you can sort of back it off a little bit, get into eco and just save your fuel and you're still up around that 50, 60K an hour. It's, it's revenue about four and a half thousand revs. It's yeah. Good, good speed, um, good on fuel, um, and quiet. You don't even hear them running. That's how, that's how good they are. Pretty quick for a four, four and a half meter boat. Why Honda? Because Honda's been yeah, so good to deal with, and why wouldn't you? Seven year warranty, great motor. Never have problems with them. Um, we sell Hondas on our boats, and I, I don't think we've had any comeback with a warranty claim in 15 years. The, the 461 with the 60 Honda on it and the trailer, um, yeah, lot of boat for about 20 grand. Uh, so this is the 510 uh, Dundee Pro. Uh, more yeah, estuary lake sort of boat. Um, but yeah, so this morning we took it out in the boat mortar and actually handled really well. So yeah, we're really happy with it. Um, this has got everything in it. So this is your casting decks, rod locker. Um, this is our demo for myself. So I build it to sort of suit what fishing we do on the on the river, on the Murray. So, so this this boat here with the 100 Honda on it, um, all decked out with all the, the gear inside, without the no electric motor, is around that 50, 55 grand. Yeah, without the wrap, the wrap's extra. This boat would suit oh, pretty much anywhere all over Australia. Um, inland waters. Unreal, your estuaries, um, your bays, your uh, your lakes out on the out on the ocean on a good day. But yeah, these top ends, it's they're a bit higher in the sides in the front, so it gives you that bit more protection. Um, and the sides are a little bit lower towards the back, so, so you can actually get in and get your fish easy and don't have to struggle to try and reach down and grab it um, if you're catching your barrow or your cod or or snapper or whatever you're catching. So it's, it's an all-rounder boat. You can. You've towed knee boards behind it. You could probably ski behind it, how quick it goes. Um, top speed at about, with 100, was about 65, 70K an hour, um, which is humming along for a five metre boat, which is a sort of inland waters boat. So it's, yeah, it's good, up, up near that bass boat sort of stuff. Yeah. The 461, so Sapphire Marine, um, that's, that's the boat they've, they've donated to the 
Eden Amateurs Fishing Classic. Yeah, great dealer, easy to get along with Wayne and, and Ben. Awesome people to deal with and yeah, they do a, do a really good job over here. Uh, you get to see the product go out the door when it's finished um, and get to see people and how happy they are to, to have it and um, then see them out in the water. That's the, that's the best bit, cruising down the river and you're like, oh, there's another one. It's, yeah, they always stop for a yarn, so it's, it's good.